welcome to Responsibility Revolution. This is Vincent Castellanos. Responsibility Revolution is taking responsibility for all things you. No one is responsible for your well-being. You are. Hello, revolutionaries, and welcome to another episode of Responsibility Revolution. Today, we are on step 11, sought through prayer and meditation to improve our conscious contact with God as we understood Him, praying only for the knowledge of His will for us and the power to carry that out. Now, every time I use the word hear Him, or I see the word hear Him, I substitute it for my own creation, my, my own interpretation of God, my own definition of God. My God doesn't have a gender. So uh, I'm going to suggest that you don't let the words he or him discourage you from the actual step, which is a very powerful step because it's talking about prayer and meditation. Now for me, prayer and meditation is something that I do on a daily basis. Um, there's a traditional prayer, the third step prayer, the seventh step prayer, the set aside prayer, the serenity prayer. There are many, many, many prayers that you can use. Um, and none of them, everything is great. None of them are wrong. None of them are bad. All prayers, any kind of prayer is fantastic. But I'm going to share with you what I do. Prayer for me, it's a conversation. Prayer for me is that opportunity that I have to open my mouth and just voice everything that's going through my head, whether it's gratitude or uncertainty or fear or curiosity or whatever it may be I just get an opportunity to put it out there something that I may want clarity on something that I may want guidance on just put it out there and then meditation for me it's quieting the mind by allowing all the thoughts to come through and allowing myself to get back into the moment into my life into the present as it is the moment as it is and in that space I create space for the answers to come so prayer for me is talking, and meditation for me is listening. But the key to step 11 is to have a really, really strong and personal contact and relationship with a power greater than yourself. If you're still not sure what that is, you need to go back to step 3 and continue to work on it until the power greater than yourself that you are tapping into is absolutely personal and it's absolutely something that you can stand behind that you can believe, that you trust, something that brings you courage, gives you willingness and, and, and clarity and guidance. It's got to be that powerful for you. Because if it isn't, then it's just words. It's just talk. And it's important here that we have an experience that is, that is grounded in action, right? It's grounded in authenticity. So, that's the journey of the 11th step. Prayer and meditation, conversation, and listening. So that's all I got for you guys this week. We're coming to the end of Responsibility Revolution. I will be taking a break. I will talk more about that in the upcoming episodes. But we have about two episodes left after this one. So, like I always say, if you want to speak to me, I always want to speak to you. So hit me up. Thank you for listening to Responsibility Revolution. I hope you have enjoyed it, and I hope that you subscribe so you can receive it every Monday. Also, remember that Responsibility Revolution is a way of life that requires work. If you're interested in finding out more about the type of work we can do together on the corporate level on a one-on-one, -on -one, please feel free to contact me at theresponsibilityrevolution.com. I really look forward to hearing from you.